Welcome. 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 All right, so what I want to do is I want to show you how to find um, the value, the point value, when we have an angle t equals pi over 3. So what I did was I have a little unit circle here. Remember, when we're dealing with the, finding the coordinate value of our angle, what we want to do is we need to write up our coordinate circle. And the coordinate circle, the unit circle, I'm sorry, the unit circle is going to give, give us our values for certain angles. And I'm just going to be concerned with the first quadrant because what I'm going to do from that first quadrant is I'll help us, um, that will help us find the rest of our angles. However, for this first one, we have a pretty basic angle. We have t equals pi over 3. So first of all, I need to determine where is pi over 3. Now remember, that's pi over 3 radians. And if you think about even a radian, right? So first of all, pi over 3, you can see right here, my answer is actually right there. It's actually not that bad. But you know, think about if halfway around a circle is pi, then pi over 3 would be, it's really kind of 1 third of that which is this point. If you think of 1 third, 2 thirds, 3 thirds. So 1 third of that is going to be the angle right here. And then we go back to our unit circle to see how do we get, what is the coordinate value at t equals 1 third, or t equals pi over 3. And the coordinate value is going to be x equal to 1 half and y equal to square root of 3 divided by 2. So there you go. That's how you find the coordinate value for the angle t equals pi over 3. Thanks.